Hey, Ken, how are you doing? Doing good, man, and you? Boy, I'm great, man. It's good to see you. Good to see you, bro. It has been a while. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah. You know, Ken and I have been best of friends. We travel the length and breadth of this country, mm -hmm. Jamaica, doing concerts and just having fun. True. You know, yeah. but um, he now become a bishop at the New Testament oh, Church of come God. On. And, you know, I'm just a, a little man down the road. <laughs> <laughs> but then none of our profession uh, changes us, no, you know. No. Don't care where we've been in life, we're still going to be friends. Mm -hmm. Because true friends never die. Never die. Hey, this pandemic is crazy, man. Terrible. And I tell you something, I know the borders are going to be open again mm -hmm. because Jesus said in his word that before his return, yeah. the Bible said before the return of Christ, men will Christ. be traveling to and fro. They'll be going here and there and um, sure. unless the word of God ain't true. Nope. But we know God cannot lie. No. Nope. But in the midst of everything that is going on, Ken, we just have to take it one day at a time. Trust God today. And when tomorrow becomes today, we do the same thing. Well, you know, I, I'm... The only thing I noticed, Jonah, is that so many persons are afraid. Fear becomes the out of the life, in the life of everybody. But not yeah. everybody, but most people. Most people. You know, because I think the persons who wants us to purchase and to, to, they push us on a limb. Oh, yeah. Because if you notice in the first area of this pandemic, when it started, the kind of fear mongering that they yeah, were yeah, pushing. Sure, sure, sure. You know, sure. people were just dying. They were yeah. showing people dying. Mm -hmm. They didn't talk about much people recovering. Right. They just talk about right. the deaths, the deaths, the deaths, the deaths. And so I, I, I asked the question, why? Why push that? You yeah. Know what I mean? when because they have an agenda. An agenda, of They have an agenda. An agenda, of course. But you know, there's one agenda that cannot no. be erased. Nope. You know, nope. Jesus is going to come again. Yep. And in the midst of everything else, we just have to stay the course. My word to everybody is just, just be encouraged. Yeah. And let's get back to the word of God. Begin to read that, use that as the base yeah, yeah, of our lives in this time. Because it is through that yeah. in which we will stand. I always remember, greater is he that is in us and he that is in the than world. he that is in the world. Don't tell me that a little virus can be greater than the Christ or the God who creates the world. Mm -hmm. He is the creator of this world. Yeah. And therefore, there's nothing too hard for him to do. That's true. But we need to learn to trust him. Mm -hmm. And we need to do it one day at, at a time. time. So since we're here, best of friends, and we used to do this mm -hmm. um, separately and together and sometimes. But, um, and by the way, Kenneth is a recording artist, just like myself. So we've got music out there. In case you need some of our stuff, then... You know, you can know how to get us through our inbox or something on Facebook, and then we'll we'll respond to you. Right but right now, we're just going to do something that was not uh, scripted. Just run the thing. One day at a time is what we're going to do. So just bear with us right here. Take it away, my friend. Oh, 
give me strength to do every day what I have to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yesterday's gone, sweet Jesus. And tomorrow may never be mine. Oh, God, yours too. Lord, help me today. That was good, man.